Hi everyone, it's Christina. Today we're taking a look at the new Radical Pandemonium. The Pandemonium features a newly designed symmetric core and it's wrapped in the Forge Plus Pearl cover stock. As you can see from the chart, the Pandemonium is a hard arcing ball and fits in between the closer pearl and the bonus in terms of motion. This ball is ideal for medium oil conditions, but I've used it on medium to light with no problem. I just had to open up my ankles more. I drilled this ball 55 by 4 and a quarter by 30, which is slightly different than my standard max flip symmetrical layout. Mainly, I upped the VAL from 20 to 30 to help smooth out the back end reaction. I noticed with my lower ball speed that pearls can sometimes get a little jumpy on me. I also scuffed the ball lightly with the scotch Bright pad just to knock some of the shine off. I'm bowling on a freshly oiled house shot. This is a ball you definitely want to give some space to. Most of my first shots looked kind of like this because I wasn't opening my angles enough. These next two shots show my ideal line for this condition, which was 15 out to about 6 or 7. I've been using this ball on league as a lane's transition. Normally, I can't stand too far left with the sim because it eventually doesn't make the corner, but I haven't had a problem with this ball doing that. On this next shot, I changed my hand position so I could show you what it was like playing more direct with this ball. So if that's your preferred line, this ball is going to work fine and you can always add more surface if you need it. On this shot, I moved my feet further left. I was still playing about third arrow, but I was sending it further out into the friction. As you can see, I had absolutely no problem with the ball recovering, something that, again that I don't normally see with Sims with my average rev rate. For more ball reviews and information on the seven brands of Brunswick, please be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Thank you for watching.